Hello, okay, everyone. It is your Black Knight. If we're recording, we're we recording. If we're recording, we're continuing on here with the Cluck and Bell adventure. Hey, so I understand that your MO is up to you, but there are steps you can take to ensure the element of surprise is on your side. Introducing a little chaos into the cartel supply line is one of them. If you do, they'll assume your arrival on the train is just an unscheduled delivery. And if nothing else, the looks on their faces will be highly amusing. Okay. So it's another setup. We're not going, we're not there yet. Okay. Again, I have not watched anything yet on how to do this setup. Disorganize. Okay, there's, there's one more setup and then we do the finale. So we'll probably just keep this video to this last setup. I didn't even read that. It's critical that our entry into the Cluck and Bell factory goes as planned. To ensure this, we need to sabotage the cartel supply lines. I've followed a line of investigation. I believe I know we can achieve this. Trust me. But thank you yourself later for being so assiduous. I try to be assiduous. I really do. I got a bag. I got an armor car. Meanwhile, make your way to the Cluck and Bell outlet on Innocence Boulevard. Alright, the time has come to throw the cartel supply lines into disarray. We need them in a state of chaos. So when our unscheduled train delivery arrives at the factory, they just wave it through. So our primary objective is to locate their depot and sabotage their fleet of delivery trucks. A secondary objective is to find a key card that will allow us access to the factory's restricted areas. Oh, and keep an eye out for a driver uniform. That can come in handy for getting into the depot to hit the trucks. Or we can just do it loud. Doing it loud is always an option. Okay, so we have the next one. We'll have to. That's the hat I'm trying to get. Only well, it's on backwards this time. They have the frontward face. Right? drivers warning their collaboration is at the garage. They won't suspect this is part of a coordinated attack. I They'll killed just him. assume it's another day in Los Santos. There's one guy left. Just another day in Los Santos. That's true. Okay, we sneak. Do we do sneaky sneaks? Gun out? Yeah, let's put the gun away. What are we gonna do now? 
This this could go badly. Sabotage the trucks, find the key card, wipe the CCTV, and get out. That way the cartel won't see you coming. Now you can blow up the trucks and do this the old-fashioned way, but the cartel will find out, and trust me, they'll be waiting for you when we hit the factory. I recommend you keep your head down. You know, there's gotta be areas that are strictly off-limits to drivers. The cartel won't want anyone seeing something they shouldn't. So that's one. There's a guy right there. Uh, there's like literally a guy staring at both the other trucks. Okay, so let me look around. I see, I think. Why do I need to grab a drill? Okay, like this guy's not moving. Not real perceptive. This guy though. Like, how are we supposed to do this? He scooches down? Okay, so maybe the blue one... Must be around there somewhere. Drill the lockers to search for the key card. Oh my goodness, how are we supposed to do that? Drill what lockers? We're gonna get shot to bits. Okay, so if the blue lights, the blue lines are, you're, you know, don't don't get noticed. Real what lockers? Like the lockers aren't marked here on the map. Those aren't lockers. Those are people who are going to shoot me 800 times in the face. I don't see any lockers in there. Like, am I going to have to kill everybody here to do this? The lockers must be in these doors here. This is going to get loud. There's just no way it's not going to get loud. How are these guys not going to notice this? I didn't notice the take them out. It's the only way to stop the cartel from knowing you're coming. I didn't notice the little bar. Now it's loud. Let's go, I didn't notice the little thing where it's like there's a meter. Where are you gonna go now? Alright, well, well oh here's a person. I'm probably gonna fail this mission. 
Yeah, we're out of lives. Can we do a fast uh, a fast redo here and get back in? All the trucks dead. Can I at least be at the factory? No, no, I can't. I'm screwed, aren't I? No, here we are. Okay. Sabotage the trucks, find the key card, wipe the CCTV, and get out. That way, the cartel won't see you coming. Now, you can blow up the trucks and do this the old-fashioned way, but the cartel will find out, and trust me, they'll be waiting for you when we hit the factory. I recommend you keep your head down. You know, there's gotta be areas that are strictly off-limits to drivers. The cartel won't want anyone seeing something they shouldn't. Okay, so we wait till this guy... Well, that's true. If it's a matter of being quick... And the sky is working. Then get out of the cone of, of vision. He's blinded by the light. Where's your ma where's your welding mask, son? That's unsafe. When you've dealt with the trucks, find that key card. Okay, so knowing what we know now. So now we watch the little meter. It's not there initially. Oh, wait, wait. Take out, okay, that's the take out witnesses. I couldn't even, I hit escape, but didn't do anything. Where did he go? We need, I think, this gun. And we should probably snack it up. I honestly don't know how it could go any other way, because I mean, you're really, it's going to be very hard to stealth this whole thing. There's a lot of witnesses. Does that mean that we've basically failed the mission and it's going to be harder? So we don't have the stealth option? We still have to drill. Well, I guess we can kill everybody first, right? Well, I gotta get down myself.
I mean, how the heck are you supposed to drill lockers open in front of people? I mean, I guess I could stealth take them out. You know, do a stealth kill everybody kind of thing. What are these little bags I'm taking? Cocaine? I mean, I don't know. I guess there's probably some money involved here, but do I really care about money? Didn't go well. Oh, escape the cartel. So if the so all we have to do is escape the cartel, then that's then maybe we didn't screw up the final mission. Should be able to escape the cartel, don't you? Are they using roads? No, one of them's not. see them on my radar. Does that mean we've escaped them? Are the cartel climbing up these roads now? Do I have to kill the cartel? We could do that. Pretty handily. You know... Fine, let's be this way. Do they keep spawning? Or is it like three cartel guys? Okay. Come here, pick up. He fell down the he went down the ravine. Well that's hilarious. Alright, you had to kill all the cartel members, not just this game. Well, mm, probably not. Probably could have gone better than it did. We got best laid plans. Okay, well then. Get a phone call? Hey, sometimes in the field, we meet the unexpected. And at that point, one must abandon all subtlety and get the job done. I pass no judgment for that. Though in this case, it does mean the cartel will be ready for you when you return for the raid. Okay, so we did make the, the final uh, the final raid harder. Well, 
The only thing I could think of is you go in with silenced weapons and you kill everybody without anything going off. And that's that's going to be tough to do. So, I mean, if we're going to do this again on my other character, we'll see what happens then. But for right now, let's just go get ready for the raid. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.